Hey everyone, how's it going? So I've just unboxed two figures for you guys today, plus the um, Bobby doll. But the two separate figures I've just unboxed for you guys were interrupted, and the video file were corrupted. So I need a really good enough device to record on, so I don't get disturbed. But uh, so I thought I'll do another video for you guys to what I've just unboxed for you guys. So. After Barbie, I did this guy. I'm so sorry. I'm very tired. So I've just unboxed um, the Gamer Edition Studios Barricade, which is a figure that I've been wanting. But after seeing all the reviews on this guy, and I didn't want to pay full price, so I got him on sale on Amazon. So if you are one of this guy, I would go to Amazon and then just pay that price, maybe. He's still a cool looking figure though, but could have been better. But I, but I, I'm still happy to have him in my collection now. Like I'm not going to buy every single gamer figure that comes out because I I'm not getting a collection bird because he's that same as the Moby and yeah, but pretty cool figure though. <sighs> and then that's his gun. All right. Enough of that. Let's get to the cool bit, the cool, the cool figure that actually came today. And I paid, I paid extra. That was my box, but I paid extra money. Game the next day, so I was outside like, for him. And here he is, guys. M P M Raw. This figure just looks heaps and bounds better than the the leader class figure. Which don't get me wrong, the leader class figure is still. Holds up there and it's still a pretty rare figure to find. I've um, got mine on eBay. Now, I'm just happy this figure doesn't have no head gimmick like the other one did. So, this figure is pretty bad, bad art, so I'm going to um, go on Matchbox in a minute and go to MGO himself and just watch this to transform it maybe. But he doesn't really war comes with these two mi missiles, this tank that were there. These here came packed separately. Um, got his giant ass claw and his other one as well, which is another, another gun. And this piece to actually, um, so you can actually pop off his arm. And basically, we had to wear a ratchet cut off his arm and his you know, one arm to fight. Um, like, it would be pretty cool to see how this compares to Jazz and everyone else, but right now, every single one of my transformers, apart from these two now, are in storage because I'm getting my room redone, so Brawl and Barricade will be the only ones I'll probably be messing around with for now. But actually, I do. I still do have the the, the generations third party figure um, of that giant uh, Grimlock still as well. So now, yes, he does have big wheels. But I know my next one was I wouldn't see how the rubber, the rubber tires would go anywhere as good. But yeah. That's pretty much about it guys, um, I'm going to now end this video, get some new things because my eyes hurt a lot, because you can see my eyes a bit swollen, um, and I'm going to go watch him go, if we can give himself, and um, learn how to transform MP and blow, back, back and forth, and I'm pretty sure these are maybe part of the transformation, <laughs> already, these might fold in, so, Maybe. And one's a bit tight, one's a bit. I don't know, man. It's just pretty wrong. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, this guy looks pretty kind of similar to but at the same time, I want to know where all these shreds will go. So. If you guys can spot please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll come back to you guys within the next video. And I'm hoping. I find something else to record on. If not, I'll have to do it on my phone. Hopefully, no one gets interrupted. So, goodbye.